What's up guys? Welcome to another video. This video we're going to be taking a look at a couple cases that VRS Design, friends of the show, have sent us to review. This is an unbiased review though. They have not seen or edited this documentation that you are about to watch. But I did want to say again that they did provide both of these free of charge and they uh, are much appreciated. And we have done VRS Design before. They do have quality gear. Alright, we've reviewed numerous things from VRS Design. So I was elated that they reached out to uh, send us a couple of reviews or cases for review for their iPhone 15 Pro line. Um, so let's go ahead and get down with it. You've probably seen we've been releasing some videos for some cases, premium style cases. I plan on doing a top five very soon, so stay tuned for that. So the first one we've got is the MagSafe TerraGuard. And again, they've got a real nice little system here where we just pull maybe. Pull. Oh, it's got a little tape on it. Oh, I could probably do it without the tape. We just got a pull tab here. That would be ideal, but we've got tape. So, pull that out. That's all it's in the box. Very, very minimalistic packaging here, right? Okay, so we've got our TerraGuard MagSafe. This is the modern and then we have the MagSafe TerraGuard Ultim. Okay, so let's go ahead and pop that open. Whoa, it's like a transformer. Okay, so pop both of those open. Holy moly, this is a completely uh, night and day comparison here. So they did send us two cases to review. So this is the TerraGuard, very, very unique design, IP15 LP airspace structure. So definitely going on the protective side here, buttons, rubbery, TPU-ish, same thing, sides, cases, let's just pop the phone in. All right, there you go. Does add some bulk. This definitely... Uh, is on the protective side of the house does put some bulk onto your phone but I gotta say looking at this appears to be pretty good when it comes to feel it's got some grippiness on the sides I like that this is pretty pretty tactile for plastic or TPU can get to the silencer really easily. Speakers are still open, plenty of room here. It's a little deep for the port, but still wide enough. I think there's not going to be any issues with some of those third party cables. We've got good lip on the screen coverage. We're just hitting case. We've got good coverage on the camera lenses. Just hitting case. So that's nice. It almost looks like there's wanting to be something pulling out here, but I don't think so. Some of these have like a kickstand built in, but this does not. So, that's pretty simple. It's a very protective case. And, um, you know, it's definitely fingerprint resistant. Now you're probably wondering, how about the MagSafe? Well, it does say it is MagSafe protected. So, let's go ahead uh, and try to do a MagSafe piece. So, I have my little stand here. So if you ever buy a, a, a case and you want a little stand, this uh, anchor stand here is phenomenal. It's a little dirty, but again, look. See how this case just cleans right up? So, this actually acts as a kickstand as well. So you can basically do this with your phone. So you don't have to have anything. You can use it as a, as a holder. This is like one of my little... Uh, top, easy, cheap tech accessories. I should do a video like that. I've got a ton of this kind of stuff, right? But, check test. That's a good magnet, okay? Hard to come off. That's what you want. That's got a great magnet for MagSafe. That ain't gonna come off. All right. Now that we've tested that out, let's go ahead and look at this beast. This is something else. So this has to 
pop open. Oh yeah. So we've got a, a door, a lens door. Ooh, that's got some nice, nice. It's got some metal here. Let's definitely protect. Uh, nice buttons. Ton of protection interior to this. This is the ultimate. Boy, that's grippy. So this is going to take it up a notch. This is this is definitely going to take it up a notch. This one's just like, hey, you're pretty well protected, but let's just put this in like the Fort Knox here of, of cases, because man, this thing is got it going on when it comes to being protective. Also, it's not as easy to put my phone into. A little tighter fit, but not, not terrible. All right, there we go. Yeah, this one just took it up a notch. That looks so cool though, look at that, that is so cool. Um, I gotta say, that's a neat looking design here um, for certain. So, as you saw, we have our camera lens. So it folds out. Looks like it is well out of the way, but let's just make certain that we don't see it when we pull up our camera and we adjust our lenses. Nope. I do not see it. Go into the widescreen mode. How close is it? Well, let's see. Does this get... Yeah. Right there. It's... Oh! It just said, see ya! That was pretty, uh, pretty harsh. Um, so I didn't want to bring that up. How far until you get it to where you see it? Right there. Like, barely move it, and it's in view. See if I can get that to where you can see it. Here's open all the way. Try to get my finger out of the view. You can already see it coming in. So it's, it's close. They did a good job. That's what you want. More lip than the last one. On the outside. Look at that. A lot of protection. Can't get any more protected on the camera lenses. And then, MagSafe ability, right? So, what do we got going on here? Whoa! Okay. <laughs> that magnet bolted on. Oh, this is a stronger magnet, too. Let's see. Uh, yeah. Uh, not going to come off. In fact, yeah. It, oh, hey, it's come off easier than I thought it was. The way it pulled it on, I was like, whoa! This thing's got some magnetism. Okay, let's see what we got here. Oh, yeah. Kickstand, shake test. Oh, I shook it off. Let's try it again. Maybe I just didn't have it on there good. That's a pretty good magnet, though. Oh, did it again. So maybe this magnet isn't quite as good, but you know, you're not going to be sitting here doing this, trying to get it off. But uh, this seems to have less magnet. Let's try this on this one again. There's no phone in it, but yeah, this one's got a more powerful magnet. Probably because this has so much protection built in, um, like, it's hard to to see it. And it almost looks like you want to just sit here and kind of turn this and mess with it. Um, but yeah, so this is pretty cool. Button-wise, it works. 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 Plenty of room on the ports. I lock it. So, there we go. You want this to have a... Uh, Kind of a cool effect. You could rock this little guy from Anchor and um, have a stand with it too. So, your choice. I'll have a link in the show notes for this as well. If you're interested in this little Anchor um, kickstand or protector, you know, I like it better than a pop socket or anything like that. One, it just looks better. Two, it's more premium quality. It's metal. Um, it's going to hold on longer. I don't stick it. It's MagSafe. And um, just, you know, it's just a nice quality item to have. And it has multi-purposes. So I'm a big fan of it. So anyway, guys, two cases from VRS Design. I'll have a link in the show notes for if you want to pick one of these up. I wouldn't put these up in the premium category. Um, Price-wise, they're not high-priced. They're more affordable than some of the previous ones we've been doing. They're not high-grade um, leather or anything like that, so I wouldn't put these in the premium. Are they protective, uh, cool, nice looking cases? Yes, uh, they're definitely in that category. I do like them, and uh, they're very rugged. That's where I would probably put them more as a rugged case design versus a stylish uh, premium luxury style, right? So 
uh, kind of just bit went off a little differently. These won't be in my running for the like the premium cases. Maybe we'll do a rugged one too. It just depends on what all kind of cases we get. So anybody like this video, give it a thumbs up, subscribe to the show, and as always, guys, thanks for watching. Have a good one. Thank you.